And let's go over to Eric, who's outside with some of the tips from Home Depot. And if you thought the acrobatics in Gary's live shot were impressive, wait until you see Richard. Oh, no, we're here for a different reason. This is Richard Lopez <laughs> with the Home Depot. Uh, we're talking about how to spruce up your lawn, make it look nice. There was a recent survey that came out that said that uh, millennials who are now old enough to buy homes, the one thing they like the most when buying a new home is the aesthetics, the lawn out front. So we have four tips. The first one is make sure you pick the right fertilizer. Talk right. about that, Richard. All right, if you want your, you want to embarrass your neighbors or make them feel like, oh God, a little jealous, they, huh? they're yeah. jealous. You want to use this fertilizer right here, lawn fertilizer. It's great. It will bruise up your lawn in, t in 72 hours. That particular brand or just in general? No, this one here. Okay. Or, but in this one here, say you got all those pesky weeds yeah. and, and whatnot. This is going to also work. It will fertilize your lawn and kill the weeds at the same time. So it, it's something great. It's you're the top notch yeah, one. Yeah, you're doing twice. Okay, the other thing too is keep it simple and go green. What does that entail? Well, keep it simple. You just make, don't don't work hard. Work simple. Work okay, easy. I'm on board with that. Yeah, and you got all different products. You have a granule here that's going to do the, what I, it's going to kill the weeds and fertilize your yard. Yeah, okay. You have a liquid here. It's going to do the simply the same thing. So when you're done with all that and you got your lawn cut and you got all everything in it, then you want to go to your little Ryobi bee kit here where it's got your weed eater, your weed eater and your blower, a little combo kit. So it's going to have everything you need. Because after you put all the work in, you want to be able to maintain your lawn and, and, and that is how you go about yeah. it, correct? Yeah, when you're done, you clean it all up and man, you, then you, all you have to do is sit back and enjoy it. Who doesn't yeah. like that? Right? Right. With the kids, with yourself, whoever. Uh, the other thing when we're talking about the aesthetics of your lawn and just the curb appeal and how beautiful it looks, it doesn't have to be in the boring green or whatever. Add a pop of color, and you have a different variety of colors. We have some mulch over there, right? Oh, yeah. We have the red, and we have the black and brown. I mean, it's whatever your preference is, we have it. it you just put two to four inches of this mulch in, your, in the area where you want it. It's going to keep all your plants moist, your trees moist. It's going to keep moisture in the ground much better. You don't have to use a lot of water. Richard Lopez with Home Depot, we appreciate you taking the time. I told you that would go by fast, right? <laughs> a bunch of amazing products that he's showing us off today, and it's going to be nice very soon. You're going to be hanging out your lawn. You want it to look good because you never know when one of those millennials is going to come by and try to buy your home. Right. I say that because I am. Back to <laughs> I like the succulents. Did you see all the succulents, the choices and stuff? Yeah. Good ideas. I love it. Fantastic. Good tips, too. All right, Pedro, what's going on? All right.